welcome back to my channel guys your favorite girl is Ajira and today we are going to be packing for the Bahamas <laughs> I've been wanting to do a pack with me video for the longest because I am definitely a type A I've been saying bride because most of you guys know I just got married type A bride type A person OCD organizational person and planner so I need to make sure I have everything I need to make sure everything is organized and neat and looks a wet so I'm usually packed and ready almost a week before the vacation like literally bag is zipped and done and I've been kind of slacking and waiting last minute. But anyway, I just wanted to take you guys along my pack journey because again, I get called extra and all of this stuff. So yeah, I just wanna show you guys my little tricks and all that good stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. First thing, um, I switched my caddy out. Um, this was my caddy, like tip. If you are a big traveler, you just need separate things. You need a separate toothbrush, you need a separate charger, a dedicated, not separate, dedicated travel items, like things you don't touch. So everything in this caddy is now makeup, but everything in my caddy, it doesn't get taken out because everything is dedicated to the caddy, to the travel. So whenever I'm ready to go travel, whatever, I just literally take this out of the closet and I put it in my suitcase. So you need a dedicated toothbrush, dedicated perfume or the little travel perfume things, um, dedicated soap, shampoo, all of that stuff remains in your caddy at all times by all means. So this was my caddy case, but I just switched it out because I got new packing cubes. But to start, I packed all my makeup. So all of my makeup, oh, I lied. <laughs> All of my hair stuff is in here. I did have a hair bag. Let me show you guys what it looked like. It's like this drawstring thing, but I don't like it because I can't physically see it. Like I'm always digging inside of it to find stuff and it's black, so it doesn't help. But this is all my hair stuff. So I don't think I need to show you guys this, but well, I'll show you. Okay, so I've really been in touch with doing my hair and, you know, not getting my hair done for vacations and being cost efficient, basically. So, I am going to be doing my hair on vacation. So, here's everything that I'm going to pack. Oh, well, here's everything in my hair bag. So, I have a detangling brush for the shower, a secured wide tube comb, a hard brush, a small comb, and an edge brush. So, those are all in there, ready to go. And then I always bring a empty spray bottle. It doesn't, I think this was actually had product in it because there's an expiration date on it. But I do have like a physical empty, like this one. But this one's a little too big, it's taking up space. So I just got one of these, like I keep these and I do have like the travel size ones too. But shoot, if you got some product that's almost empty, throw it out and this is good um, for my girlies who do twist out, who just need to put some water on their hair really quick small effective and boom so that's there um i hate <laughs> i'm not gonna lie i hate packing like refilling bottles and using hair and shampoo because half the time i don't label them and i just don't know what they are so i just switched over to natives um deodorant so their shampoo and conditioner the ingredients are good so while i'm away i just gotta do what i gotta do so these are good this is their shampoo and conditioner and they smell phenomenal and they've been working so far for my hair just for the time being while i'm away i got some travel um got to be my secured edge brush live for this you need to go over to their website and check them out um this is actually um sunscreen for your hair never heard of but i've been using it I threw some edge control in here. This is my Aunt Jackie's curling cream. I actually think I need to put some more in here. Don't judge me because, yeah, this isn't a proper like traveling container, but yeah. I have a clip. I have my little scalp uh, shampoo brush thing, because yes, I do need it. I have some leave-in conditioner. I have some, ooh, 
I have some scrunchies, some rubber bands, some clips when I'm washing my hair, some bobby pins in this little reusable Ziploc bag, and then I have some eco styling gel if I want to throw my hair in a ponytail or something. Travel size, and then you can refill this as well. Those are all going in here. Just throwing them everything in here. Oh, and of course, my Zakir bonnet. Live by this as well. Like I said, here's Zakir.com. Go check them out. And we're just going to snuggle all this good stuff in here. Okay, so hair is done. Next, I just threw all of... I probably do need to get like an actual makeup bag, but this does the job. Um, so I'm not going to take all my makeup out, but here's all my makeup in one little place. I do have a travel mirror, but this just fell out of like a little frame that I had. So I just threw this babble in here because my travel mirror is big. I do need to get a smaller one. I'll show you guys what it looks like. Um, and these are some old little card things that I use nonetheless. And then again, a reusable Ziploc bag. I just throw all my brushes in here to keep them from dirtying up the bag and my little those. So that is all of my makeup. Makeup is packed. Then I have the caddy. So this is my new caddy bag. We're gonna see how I like her only because I'm used to my white bag that I just showed you guys. This is also a travel towel because I don't, mm -mm, I like to, yes, I'm going to a resort, but I always just like to be prepared. So this is why, one example of why I'm called extra because yes, I'm bringing my own towel. It's an antibacterial towel, travel towel. So this always is in my suitcase, but the caddy. So I'm not sure how I feel about it because I'm not used to it yet. Um, but I do like the idea that it like can hang or whatever. So here we go. So again, this, all of this stuff stays in here. So I'm gonna start with this little zipper. So let me lay it flat so you guys can see exactly what it looked like. Okay, I feel like you need some light. Hold on. Give me some light. Okay, so here's the caddy. So in this little zip pocket thing, I just have some like small things that I'm not gonna need on a daily basis. So I pack some vitamin C and or liquid IV. I have some band-aids, some shout uh, wipe to go things, some nail glue because it's 2023 and we are doing press-ons. Bloop. Um, what else do I have in here? And just a little small nail file. So that's it. So up here, I got my toothbrush and some toothpaste and some tongue scraper things. Over here, I have some tr some little travel q-tips these are actually from shein don't judge me but they're golden they're like travel washcloths so i use these for my face they are like like in a little tablet you wet them and they expand and some cotton balls and now again i don't travel without a washcloth of some sort this is an exfoliating one but yes a towel and a washcloth is a must because, again, they're just too close to my private areas that I just can't take those chances. Um, so we have this. This. I can't right now. <laughs> and so within this bag, I have like a little plastic reusable bag. So God forbid any of the liquid spill. We don't got time for that. Okay, so we have our face washes and moisturizer. We got some makeup remover. And this is why you need the cotton balls. We have our castor oil. I just like to put this on my face, dab it on my face a little bit and on my lips when I, you know, finish my skincare routine. We got our body lotion. We have our Dr. Barner's body soap because you need that. Wash your ass. And then I have one. So this is what I was talking about. Okay. And then this is like my little travel perfume container thing. So you don't have to necessarily bring if you have like a big bottle of your favorite scent and you don't want to bring the whole thing, this will change your life. So you just take the cap off of your perfume that you want to bring and you literally just throw this on top and squeeze it out. And now you have your perfume to go. So this is one. Um, and then I have this Patrick, I think this is Patrick Tar, Patrick Tay, um, body oil, shimmer, whatever. I'm waiting for Rihanna to release hers. 
I threw some sunscreen in here because I have my spray one, but I like to put sunscreen on my face. I got a little bit of Vaseline. Lysol is a must. I usually have two of these. I'll put one in my caddy and then I'll put one on my little personal bag to spray whatever, whatever. So make sure you get your Lysol and spray the room, your sheets, the, the remotes, the phone, the doorknobs, please, please. And I got a little um, into the night perfume. I like to spray this at night. <laughs> As I'm doing this, I'm just like, you're just so extra, like why? But I use all of my stuff. We got some bug repellent um, spray in a travel size bottle. Again, shout out to Native. This is literally the best, like, good ingredient non aluminum free deodorant so shout out to them um this is like my little travel pill container isn't this so cute i got this from target like mad long ago but i just have some advil in here yeah. always have a razor and this is shout out to rosie thank you for this baby she got me my miss dior perfume um so this is a travel size Perfume and I keep this in my caddy because it's just small. I do like the perfume, but I don't love it So it just became my travel Perfume so I keep this in my caddy all the time and then I have my black girl sunscreen So this is why I said I ha also have like my squirt out sunscreen because I like to have both and Yeah, so that is the caddy. We're gonna zip the plastic back up throw in our rag so in our little bug repellent fan, zip this babble up, and the caddy is packed, okay? We have all of our essentials ready to go. Bloop. So next, I'm gonna pack my sunglasses. So I'm packing a total of five pairs of sunglasses, and this is a lifesaver. If you're a sunglass girly, you're Sunny's girl, you need this. This is gonna protect your glasses and you got a whole you got a whole case right here boom okay so let me show you that works it just unravels you throw them in there like that snap them in next throw them in there snap it up next and that's it that is e that's e that's o And I like to keep like a little uh, cloth thing to clean the glasses inside. And then you just roll it back up. And now you got five different pairs of sunglasses ready to go. Done. You guys need this. I'm not gonna bring this because I don't necessarily need it being where I'm going. Um, but this is a travel safe. Like it's literally a lifesaver. I'll go into more into that next time I need it. But this is a portable laundry bag. So it zips out and you can throw your laundry in here, baby. Don't be mixing your dirty clothes with your clean clothes, okay? And so you just zip it back up and it's ready to go. So we're gonna throw that in our suitcase in a minute. I was grabbing my shoe bags. Okay, so here are my shoe bags. I need you guys, I need you guys to separate your shoes from your clothes some way. If you need to get a plastic bag, you need to get a reusable bag, please do it. So, this one I like to use for my shower shoes. I don't know why, it just stands out as the only cream color. Because they only gave me one. I ordered like this pack of packing cubes and they only gave me one shoe bag. Like, okay. So, these are, I'm actually going to put my shower shoes. These are my shower shoes. And you need shower shoes when you're traveling please get some shower shoes target always has them um amazon has them i can find some and link them below and then these are just my some shoes i'm gonna put these together so i'm just gonna throw them in ya. Yeah. one pair of shower shoes and then i'm gonna throw all of my flats in one bag as well so these are all my the flats i'm bringing and then i'm bringing a total of four pairs of heels all right so here's packing cube number one first we're gonna pack all of the bathing suits 
and cover up. So I'm gonna throw my cover ups and bathing suits all in here. So I think I have a total of six bathing the suits. And the packing cubes really like help me stay organized because I know where everything is. So if I'm looking for a bathing suit, I can just go right to the bathing suit cube and that's it. And they're not even all that expensive. So we're just gonna fold all the bathing suits up with their matching cover up and just throw them in here. Bailing tubes, packed, ready to go. This one, I'm just gonna put, obviously, as you can see, my underwear and my pajamas in. I don't even know how I got this stain on here, but I'm pissed. Underwear, pajamas. Next, we're gonna start with our outfits. So, I'm gonna make this big one, <clears throat> like my casual whatever outfits. The only thing I don't like about these packing cubes or the set is that they don't give you like a small, a small size cube, like this one. Like I need this size cube. So all of them are kind of massive which kind of defeats the purpose. But I do like that they have like these little reinsurance clips because that helps like most of the clothes stay in place. But here are the outfits. So these are just gonna be like casual, like something to throw on really quick. Cube bag. Well, it looks like I can fit most of all my clothes up in here. My outfits. These are like my dresses. Okay, so all of my outfits fit right in here, which is perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I typically would separate them by like casual excursion, you know? But these cubes are so big. Outfits packed. Okay, next I have jewelry. It's not as packed. But here's all of my jewelry. I typically, I don't really like this one because of the material, but I have it linked below. If you want a jewelry like organizer, if you're a big jewelry wearer, you definitely need this. Keep your jewelry organized, clean, and safe. Next, I have all of my little um, charging, chargers, electronics. I actually have, I need to get another one. Probably should have ordered one. But I actually have like a actual like case for all my wires to like stay organized. But I don't like it because it's small. So I need to get another one. So I'm just gonna put them in my handy dandy plastic baggie. So we have our phone charger, phone charger. We have our camera charger, charger for our travel light, charger for my iPad, charger for my iPad, my SD, an another SD card, SD reader for editing purposes, and another additional charger, just in case. I'm gonna just throw them all in this reusable baggy and this goes on the plane with me on my in my personal bag because i've been eating my charges 
Oh, and my light. Almost forgot my light. <clears throat> okay, and so now for this last packing cube, I'm going to put all of my bags in here because why not? Okay, so I have this little beach bag, handbag. I have a tote bag. I love to travel with a tote bag. These were actually my welcome bags for our, it wasn't our honeymoon, but our little wedding, after wedding celebration with everyone. We went to Jamaica, how cute. So I like to just have a little tote bag that's a little bit bigger, just in case, whatever. Magic Clemus black bag. Shout out to my hubby for this bag. I absolutely love this bag. I need another one because I'm always wearing this bag. Um, waterproof fanny pack, essential. And I also had these. Um, it's said to have and to hold your key, your room key. Um, so I'm just gonna bring this because I gave these out as well. So all of the bags are gonna go in here just to keep everything together. And to be extra, because we love extra moments, don't we? I'm just gonna throw all those baggies in there. So all of my bags are packed. Chargers are packed, and here's my passport holder. So I'm gonna go grab my passport and throw her in there, and then let's go over to the suitcase. I need to get an uh, um, uh, electric scale because sometimes this can play me out. So we gotta set it to zero. And this is also essential because if you're an overpacker like me, you don't wanna be at the airport opening up your suitcase. So please get one of these. So all you have to do is basically just hook it and then pull it and hold it. 55. All right, let's try it again. Maybe let's try it again. Okay, so we're gonna, I don't know what we're gonna take out, but that's the sign point. Okay, I'm gonna take some stuff out of the bag and then I'll just bring you guys back for packing my personal bag. So here's everything that I'm going to be packing in my personal bag. So I already lights all this down, but you know what actually, cause we don't do outside stuff on the beach. Okay, so I always, like to bring an empty water bottle just so I can fill up if I need to at the airport or wherever. So I got my water bottle. I have my pouch of snacks because we always come prepared. I like to pack my little munchies. Let me just throw these in there now. I have my book. I'm currently reading Seven Days in June. My um, charges. Those all go in the bag. And I've learned this is now my second time being stranded without my luggage. And I thought it would never happen to me. So I just have a pair of underwear, a bodycon dress, and some socks in case my feet get cold on the plane. Just throwing that in there. I got my mask my reusable pouch, my wet ones, and my retainer case. Put those in the front pocket. And this is like a little pouch as well, just to have like loose stuff. Oh, so very important. I'm not gonna open this, but you need to make a copy of your passport. You need to make a copy of your passport. Just let that settle in. And don't keep it with your passport because in case, God forbid, you lose your passport, you have a copy of it. So I'm just putting this in here. So I just have um, some Honey Pot Feminine Wipes, some Lysol because when I get out of TSA, I'm spraying my bag down. Um, 
some tissue, lip gloss, lipstick, and a pen. That's all in there. Then I got my sunnies and my little portable fan, okay? So I'm just gonna throw all the rest of this in the bar because I'm going to have to make room for some more ish to go in here. Sunnies I'll put on the side. As for, I'm gonna throw it in the pocket. Okay, and that's everything that goes in my personal bag. 